Monica and Emma were just chilling when Sky came to tell them a new aqua park is opening. Now they're so excited! They've been waiting for this since last summer. We need to pick out some outfits to impress that handsome lifeguard Jackson. They could seduce a snowman like this, but he's swimming too. These girls are nowhere near ready. What about our tickets? <laughs> what do you mean they're sold out? For the rest of the summer? Great, now we'll have to put off all our awesome plans for next year again. What if we make a water park right in our own living room? Think that's crazy? Just jump in the water. It's so cold that her teeth are chattering like a snare drum. Isn't she so hot that the water should just boil right away? Her friends will help out. Okay. Give us some heat, Sky. That's more like it. Who wants Emma soup? <laughs> Sky went a little overboard. The kettle is whistling. Hmm, I'd love some Earl Grey tea right now. <laughs> that little sprinkle of Emma makes it even sweeter. Sky likes it. What? Instagram is full of photos of people at the water park. If we post our living room pool, people would only laugh at us. Bummer. Everyone else is posting about their hot tropical vacations. Sky knows how to help. Using a toilet lid as a plane window? Her friends are cracking up. Monica can actually fix this. She's done this sort of thing before. Taking a picture in front of a drawing could work, but someone's already hating on them in the comments. Seriously? Why are people like this? Monica doesn't like swimming. Her earrings keep trying to drown her, but she loves chilling on a pool chair. Although it's hard to find a free one. Sky got there first. Okay, fine. The paint's not dry yet. Uh -huh. Oh look, we have a zebra in the house. Yeah. Emma is so messy. The whole pool is covered in chips. Can you not? But a floating table is perfect. It doesn't last long though. Sky wants to make sure her friend eats healthy. You're welcome. The chips didn't stay locked up for long. Monica watches a lot of cop shows. She knows how to save everyone. That seems fair. Sky wants to swim too, but Emma thinks it's too dangerous. It's too deep, and Sky isn't a great swimmer. Emma needs the swim ring more. What's the point of a pool you can't swim in? No fair. Sky remembered about a kitty pool. It's small, but it's all hers. Her cracks are so full of sand from her last vacation. She can use that for something awesome. A sand pool is like a mini beach. She can play with it too. She just found something. A precious stone. So lucky. What? Turns out walking on the beach can come in handy. Maybe she can build her own water park. The paint on the lounge chair is done, so now we can relax. Monica always gets a sunburn, but she probably won't get sunburnt here. Well, that's no good. A sun-shaped projector will totally do the trick. Now she can show off her summery tan. Monica is flying too close to the sun. You could fry an egg on her. That's what Skye is doing. Who wants toast? It's a little burnt, but whatever. Oh no, her frying pan woke up, and she's furious. What? Huh? Skye is happy to share her food. Oh, well that's nice. Monica put two whole tubes of sunscreen on Emma. While Skye tries to make some money by doing tours. It's not much, but it's honest work. The pool isn't that impressive. We brought it here, you know. That slide is interesting. And a monkey enclosure is very cool. The mirror thing is funny, but me. Sky will have to give her money back. 
Ugh, sorry, all I have is a banana. Every good resort needs a bar, especially one in a hotel. Mm -hmm. So let's build one. Soon the bar is ready to go. Just decorate it a little more. But can we do without a real bartender? Mm. <laughs> of course not! <laughs> Here we go. What can I get ya? A tropical cocktail? <laughs> you got it. Sky watched a video on YouTube, so she's practically a pro. Look at her mixing ingredients and shaking them up. What about the ice? <laughs> Impressive! Oops, things got real funny real fast. <laughs> Let's watch that video again, when my head stops hurting. Emma's mom is back from work! A pool? Okay. Unbelievable! But swimming without a cap is even worse! One time she came out of the water bald, and she doesn't want to try that again. Swim cap or bald cap? <laughs> Up to you. That goes for everyone! When Monica was in the Bahamas, she learned how to do face paint! Time to test it out! Now is the perfect time! Wow, that looks good! She's talented! She made herself look gorgeous! Sky's not impressed. She's never been to the Bahamas, but her uncle is a tattoo artist. Look at that! Comment below and tell us whose design you like more. Water guns are so much fun to play with. The girls are armed, dangerous, and beautiful. <laughs> this is exciting! Emma is regretting her choice, but Monica is doing great! Emma thinks that's unfair. Shooting a judge results in an immediate disqualification for both of you. Sorry. Jumping into the pool is another great way to compete. The judges aren't impressed by Emma's jump. Monica will show her how it's done. Love dive! The judge's decision is very controversial. Sky has something impressive. One time, her parents forgot her at a trampoline park over the weekend. She knows a lot about jumps. Ew. And she's about to do something risky. Cover your eyes! Oops, she broke through the ceiling! That was impressive for sure. The girls earned some nice cold lemonade. They won't let Sky be the bartender anymore. They'll make it themselves. But Sky came to try the drinks. Okay. Too sour! Sky's face got okay. so wrinkled that she looks like her grandma. <laughs> Let's add some more sugar, but not to Sky's lemonade. They're so selfish. So what? Not everyone can handle the sweet life. The girls have so many dirty dishes, and of course the youngest one will have to wash them. No fair! She wants to swim too. Can she maybe multitask? What's this? Good thing nobody asked her to wash the floor. Sky is doing her skincare routine. And she's out of sunscreen. There's none left for Emma. We have to think of something. Otherwise, she'll get horrifically sunburnt. Where are all these flies from? And why are they so into Emma? Does Sky know? Maybe, but she won't say. She's doing fine. Emma is surprised to see an empty jar of mayo. Now it makes sense where the flies came from and what that sunscreen was. As soon as Sky relaxes, her friends give her a bunch of clothes to iron as punishment for all of her antics. Justice is served. While they're having fun in the pool, Cinderella does their dirty work. If you can turn a pumpkin into a carriage, you can totally turn an ironing board into a surfboard. The clothes are still wrinkled, but Sky is happy. Surf's up! The frisbee is flying through the air like the world's smallest UFO. Ooh. Emma and Monica are playing, but the living room isn't the best place for it. And Skye's head isn't a good chandelier. That's not a bright idea. Fresh fruit seems like a blessing, but it's actually a lot of work. Nobody was expecting guests, but here they are. The girls are shook. Is this another one of Sky's pranks with a hundred pizzas and cops again? No, nope, just tourists. This looks like a good opportunity to make some money. How about a tour? Pay up front, no refunds. 
This resort was founded by one brilliant woman and two monkeys. What? Emma and Monica are going to have to update the script. But as long as the customers are happy and we have money, this is going to be the hottest resort in the world. Hashtag Tropical Paradise. Emma's not happy with the food the cafeteria offers. She's been choosing for 20 minutes. There's a huge line behind her. And the crowd is out of control. Lunchtime is going to end soon, and they haven't even eaten yet. Jenny knows how to distract the rich girl. She can't say no to a diamond, even if it's fake. But she's going to find out about it too late. She doesn't even know what's inside. The expression on her face was priceless. But now she's not making everyone wait. Emma doesn't have any friends. No one's written to her for so long that her phone got covered with spider webs. But everyone messages the poor students all the time. She can't catch a break. Emma only laughs at her cheap phone that loses its charge after five minutes. A real crown of Queen Anna was delivered to college. No one can touch this rare exhibit. How is it possible that a gorgeous crown is not on Emma's head? Now she wants it more than anything in the world. Loyal servant will get it, whatever it takes. The security system is the same as Emma's kitchen has. Nick has passed by it numerous times on the way to the fridge. If he can imagine the crown is a sandwich, then everything will work out. But the crown is only a hologram. Rich girl is furious to hear news like this. But where's the real crown? We can only guess. Wow, Jenny has such a cool bag. She made it herself. Emma is trying to draw attention with her purse. It's the latest Troom fashion collection. But the guys don't seem to care. The indifference of others annoys her. Nick decided that if the boss's purse needs more shine, there can never be too many diamonds. Emma should always be sparkling. This purse became too heavy for this little lady. But now everyone's looking at her. She didn't want this kind of attention. But even this strong guy can't pick up this purse. The friends are gonna take a selfie. No one called Emma. It's really unfair. She's taking a picture herself. And of course, she looks too sad. You can't put that on Instagram. Expensive accessories always cheered up the rich girl. Personal photographer overdid it with a flash. The guys literally went blind and can't find the way out. Emma is sure that her beauty had this effect on them. A new toy of the rich girl, a gorgeous diamond. Everyone needs to check it out and start being jealous of Emma. But all the eyes are on the organizer Jenny made. The students are more impressed by that than by precious stones. Fools. Jenny has so little money. Emma finds her poverty fun. She's weird in her own way. She can afford the most expensive cakes, but she hasn't got a normal servant yet. Clumsy Nick dropped everything. One more good day is ruined. Emma is asking for a marker to highlight the topic of the lesson. Jenny's always happy to help her friend. Emma couldn't ignore her classmate's horrible manicure. Jenny feels a little embarrassed, but Jenny's poverty only makes her stronger. She's gonna fix her manicure with cardboard. Yeah, you heard right, cardboard. Emma has her own personal manicurist. What do you think whose manicure is better? Comment below. Nothing brings you closer than having lunch together. Emma decided to give her classmates the most expensive burgers. Jenny was left hungry. She didn't get anything from the rich student. Looks like the burgers have a surprise. That's why they're so expensive. Nothing can save Andy's tooth. Miss Ruby asked everyone to bring laptops to class. Emma, of course, has a diamond laptop. It's limited edition. Jenny uses a cardboard laptop. She made it herself. The classmates love it, except the rich girl. It's easy to destroy cardboard with water. But the clumsy janitor found even a clumsy her servant Nick. And it worked against Emma, as always. You can't bring such weapons to college. The rich student is sure that you can get the guy with beautiful rings. But this simpleton knows nothing about precious stones and about beauty, too. How can you not notice how pretty and rich Emma is? 
In addition, she's a very generous girl. No one can truly appreciate her. Emma's expensive pen has run out of ink. She's not gonna write with a pen of her poor classmates. She has help for situations like this. Nick does everything himself. Jenny got an A again. Great job. Emma got an A too. But it's not really her grade. There's a new straight A student in class. Nick, congratulations! And Emma will have to do the test on her own. Jenny's cardboard locker is completely out of order. She's been trying to close it for 20 minutes. But the rich girl can open her locker with one push of a button. Emma finds Jenny's fight with the locker door funny. But the good guy will always help the good girl out. Her classmate thinks it's unfair. She also wants a good guy who would take care of her and wake love inside her with a kiss. Just like the tale about Rapunzel. But she's too moody to be happy. What? Look what ring Jenny has. She made it herself. Emma also has something to show off. She has such a huge diamond. Unbelievable! Jenny is inviting her classmate to have lunch together. Looks like the diamond is too big. Emma will have to stay and solve a couple more problems. Did you like our new video? Then comment below and tell us about your best vacation ever.